Welcome back, this is Yamachak, and today we're going to play Hell on Earth SWAT. Because hard is just far too easy. Uh, and we are going to go to Kokiri Forest. Why not? I don't think this is a very good level, but I really like Zelda. So. That's okay. I want the stones. There should be... Give me my stones. There should be stones here. Oh, right. We're on Hell on Earth. I forgot. I was like, why are they so fast? What's going on? Now we're in Hell on Earth. I forgot. Okay. You guys have to go. I'm sorry, but you have to go. These guys are the cysts, or are these guys the clocks, and those guys the cysts. I don't really know. It's nice to have an actual weapon at the start of Hell on Earth, because I've been doing um, the medic Hell on Earth runs. And you don't start with a weapon, you just start with a little pistol, you know, and that's no good. Okay, apparently. We're going to be using a pistol on this anyway. Yeah, I panicked a bit with the... I had to spray a bit. It's okay, though. There's one more Zed. I don't know where... Okay, over there. That's okay. I believe we should get enough money to get our nail gun on this wave, and then basically the world is our oyster. I never understood that expression. Oh boy. Like, is the world our oyster supposed to mean that like we can do whatever we want with it, or? I don't know. Never understood it. Your treasure to do as you see fit. The textures are... These are the textures that it was in the game, though, right? And back then, these these looked pretty good. Ah. Oh. Deku tree. All Zed's on the way. Start to wrap things up, as they say. Where's my nail gun? There's my nail gun. I need this ammunition. That gets us somewhere good. We should be fine. Um, we might stay here. Try camping around the Deku Tree. Ooh, more ammo. Nice. I don't know where the they can spawn. Probably from there and from over here is my guess. I'd be surprised if they can come from the other side. So they can't come from the uh, the inside of the tree. Oh yeah, they're bouncing. Look at that. That's sweet. Get rid of that, dude. He's the main problem. Edars are just so annoying. They shouldn't exist. I'm sorry. So with this, do I want to shoot his face? Probably not. Probably want to shoot his his knee. Is this an unlimited ammo crate? No, just a very plentiful ammo crate. I am gracious for your gift, Here's map your developer. Oh, hello. What if I don't want to wash my ears? Oh, 
Okay, so we're gonna try out the the knee shots here. Yeah, knee shots seem like a lot better. Break his legs. Works better than breaking his face. This cat's back in the game. What are these? They're very slow. Have they just not found me yet, or are they like way far away? Way far away, okay. It's a bit of a strange scope for being able to accurately aim. But you know, it works. We were spot on with the ammunition that we used today. Can we go up here? What are you how, what are you talking about? That is finicky to say to say the least. Okay, so we're going to go for ammunition and then I think we're going to pick up a P90. Um rather than upgrading immediately because I need to make sure I have enough killing power to actually kill things. Uh, we're going to use the P90 because, again, I like it. Um, and for at least the little bit, we don't really need to uh, to worry too much about um, you know, high damage output, like with the With the, uh, the nail gun. Right about now we do kind of want to worry about that though. I like being down here. This is a good spot to be. It worked out pretty well for us. There's a lot of ammunition. I don't like maps that give you like unlimited ammunition. I know it's just saying I'm gracious for your gifts, but... I'm, I'm really not. I think that it's more fun when you have to worry about ammunition. Like that's a part of the game to me is ammunition, um, like rationing almost. A part that I'm usually not that good at, but you know that that's my fault, not the map developer's fault. I love the P90. Just the scope on it is just so satisfying to me. Familiar, maybe. Where do we got these guys coming from? Right over there. And over here. Sure. This is okay. Uh, final guy should be a real fleshy. Oh my. I'm not very concerned about it though. Because <laughs> this gun really messes up the flesh pounds. Oh boy. Now we get to upgrade the nail gun. You can kind of like get away from them easy by jumping across that stuff. Because they can't. They are incapable of making these jumps. So if you do it, you kind of put some distance between you, you know? Uh, for the boss fight. I guess we're going to not want to be down here because pa uh, Matriarch down here, I don't see going very well at all. I heard pounding. From where? Right down here. Oh, and a whole lot of pounding from over there. We're going to have to take you up.
Oh boy. This is a lot of, of fleshies. And that's a real fleshy. We're gonna have to toss a nade out on this one, I think. How, I like did so. Oh come on! I don't want to lose. We might. This cat's back in the game. Not far off from losing. You're not trapping me. Oh, this is a little hectic. <gasps> oh, no. Really? That's not good. He's taking out a scrake. But this does not seem like a good time to me. Not everything's dark. It's okay. Don't worry about it. Um, when I want the ammunition, it's just not there. Joy. Okay. Um, I think we're gonna have to use up all that P90 ammunition to be able to kill this uh, scrape. I'm not sure why we ran out of. I didn't. I feel like I had. I didn't. Like I don't feel like I shot that many. But maybe I we did have a few flush pounds, so I did have to shoot quite a number of nail gun shots. I feel like it wasn't that many though, you know? Worked out okay in the end. Hell on Earth feels a lot less hectic to me now. Like, you, like, when I first did it, it was really, really hectic, but I think I'm getting used to... I think I'm building good habits. And it's uh, it's making a difference on how well I can handle myself in Hell on Earth. Which is nice. I want to continue to build good habits. You know? Can you go through there? I wonder. Make sure that's upgraded. Upgrade that. Probably should get rid of the P90. If I'm being completely real with you. But I'm not gonna. Uh, as for where we fight this, I really don't know. Here. We can kind of kite around this thing, maybe. Okay. Patty shouldn't be a problem. I'm going to try the same strategy of just getting right up in his face and completely annihilating him. See if it works. As long as we don't die to uh, some of these guys spawning behind us, it almost actually worked. It actually almost worked. Okay, this isn't good though. Yeah. It would have worked if I could have um, killed him, but I wasn't able to chase him down well enough. 
the damage on his back wasn't quite good enough. Maybe I should have been aiming for his leg, but I was worried about the spread. Maybe I should have switched to single fire mode and aimed for his, uh, his leg. Might have worked out. That wasn't too bad, though. I mean, SWAT's kind of not really a good perk to be killing bosses with anyway, so that I did that well I think is not bad. I probably could have finished it if I uh, if I didn't go for the stand in his face and try to just take him down quickly. I probably could have finished it, but that's okay. Um, yeah, that's going to do it for this episode. Thank you for watching, and uh, see you next time. Bye-bye.